welcome back and welcome to another Mystery Monday. Today I have got four of these um, mini Mickey Mouse Funko Mystery Pin sets which were released from Box Lunch. So I ordered four of these, there are eight in the set, so I'm hoping, whoops, if I stop chucking them around the place, I'm hoping that we can complete the set. Who knows, maybe we'll have all the luck in the world and be able to complete a set just with the minimum number of boxes. Fingers crossed because it can cost quite a bit to get these shipped over to the UK. Um, so for the ones that I don't get, I'll probably end up having to trade. So I've got four of these to get open. Before I do that though, I would just like to remind you all that I am taking part in a couple of giveaways at the moment. So in last Mystery Monday, I opened up a mystery box full of Disney mystery items, which is being passed around a bunch of Disney YouTubers that recently arrived at the next person's location. So a video will be popping up if it hasn't done already by the time I post this. So you get to watch a bunch of us open up Disney mystery items and then be in with the chance of winning 17 mystery items yourself and a um, 100 Disney, $100 Disney store voucher or gift card inside that box as well. So an absolutely amazing giveaway and so much fun to watch and be a part of. So a link for that will be above my head in a second. And then I also have another giveaway which I've teamed up with the Magical Pinbox UK who have offered me a box of your own to offer to you. So um, if you want to be in a chance of winning that, it is open internationally. So then uh, again, another link will be flashing above my head if you are interested in entering that. But let's get some mystery boxes open. I've just dropped another one on the floor, hang on. So I think the reason why I keep dropping these is that they are much smaller than the mystery boxes that we are used to getting from the parks. So this is a very tiny little box as you can see, but the reason that I love this collection is because they are themed around Funko Pops and I am a Funko addict. I have loads of these behind me on my desk and I love that these were released uh, for Mickey's 90th birthday. We've got loads of different Mickeys on here. There are a few of these that I'm really hoping for. Like I say, I'd like to try and complete the set in one go if I can, but I really love Sorcerer Mickey or Sorcerer's Apprentice Mickey, um, this one here. I also would love to get the Firefighter Mickey. So my dad was a fireman, so um, would love to get the Firefighter one. And Steamboat Willie as well, I would love to get. Basically, I like any of the black and white ones. Um, I think this is from Plain Crazy. I'm not 100% sure on where some of these characters are from, but this looks like a kind of band conductor Mickey, maybe. Um, this one, Sorcerer Mickey. This one kind of looks like House of Mouse Mickey, but I think it looks like a, again, another conductor. Brave Little Taylor. A Christmas Mickey, Plain Crazy, a Firefighter Mickey, and then the Chaser is the Steamboat one. So um, I don't know if that will be a lower limited edition. It doesn't really say much on the back of the box about the, um, the likelihood of achieving that Chaser. So like I said, we've got four of these to open up. Fingers crossed we can complete the set. Let's get the first one open. At least I love opening the first one because I know there aren't gonna be any doubles inside. Guaranteed no doubles. So as I'm opening it up, there is a blind bag inside. Just one blind bag. <gasps> I've made a massive error. There's one pin inside each box. It clearly states on the front of the box, contains one collectible pin. So there is absolutely no way that I'm going to be able to complete this set. No wonder these boxes are so flipping tiny. They only have one pin inside. Oh no, what am I gonna do? I'm gonna have to order more. Oh well, um, hopefully we can get four of the set. Oh dear, I'm such an idiot. So um, no wonder that these were um, quite cheap. I thought it was cheap for two pins, but nope, one pin. Oh well. These are very, very tough plastic. I'm gonna have to use my scissors to open these up. At least I can be happier that, <gasps> yay! We got a great one as our first pin and we've got the Sorcerer's Apprentice Mickey. So at least the bonus of having um, just one pin in the box is that the pins are actually bigger than I was expecting them to be. 
So we have got Sorcerer Mickey. I love that he's carrying his two pails of water in this. Really, really cool pin. So happy that we got this one. So this might go a little bit quicker than I originally anticipated because I did think I would have eight pins to show you guys, but we have four. Oh. By the way, I've just noticed the price on here is $9.90 um, in US dollars for one pin, not two pins. Oh, we've got a little rip tear on here, so we can do this. We've got, oh, we've got the band conductor Mickey. Pretty sure it's a band conductor because he's got a little baton thing. So here is our second one. I really love the colours on this one as well. Um, let me know. I'm really not sure what this is from, but he kind of looks like he's leading a band. Like a, um, like a parade band, not a orchestra band. If that makes sense. I think the other one is like an orchestra band. Okay, so our third one is... It's really hard to feel through these plastic bags. They're really, really, really thick plastic. <gasps> Yay! Oh my god, I'm having such great luck. I think this is my favourite one of the set so far. I love it. And we got Firefighter Mickey. I love that this is black and white. I kind of wish all of these pins were black and white because they just look so stunning. Really, really loving this one. I love, love, love this so much. We got Mickey as a firefighter. You know, I may have to start a Mickey firefighter collection. I really love this. Like I say, very, very special and meaningful to me. Okay, last one. We're having really good luck so far. What have we got left to get? Um, oh, I would love the chaser, obviously. We need the chaser, please, 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 please. Ooh. Well, we got no doubles. How amazing is that? No doubles, but we have got a Christmas Mickey this time. So a little bit late to the season, but we've got Mickey in a Santa hat holding a Christmas present. So this is a really cool one. Will be great for um, a Christmas pin board, but will probably um, be put away for storage until next Christmas time. But a really cool one. I can't believe we didn't get any doubles. So I'm so pleased with that. I mean, I'm disappointed that I only have four and not eight when I thought I'd be able to complete the set in one go. But I'm really happy that we didn't get any doubles. I got two of the ones that I really wanted. I really love that Firefighter Mickey pin. That is by far my favourite. Let me know in the comments down below which was your favourite from this set. And thank you so much for popping over for Mystery Monday again. I will see you again soon. Bye.